Show opened up with Bray Wyatt coming out to do the promo. He said last night was the beginning of the end. He had a chance to slay the beast, save everybody from damnation. It was taken from him. Rambled on and on, and he's running down everybody in the match, and out comes Roman Reigns. And Roman makes it quick. He says, this is what happens when you talk trash in my yard. Punches him, and they have a very, very long match. Went through two commercial breaks. Crowd's going crazy for Roman Reigns. Loud dueling chants. Bray put on no less than four different chin locks during this match. He looked very tired by the end. He really did. And, they, you know, they even pointed that out, which was I thought was really weird. Yep. When he was doing the punches in the mount, and the punches were looking terrible. And, I mean, it was Booker? It was Corey Graves said fatigue Corey... is setting in. Yeah, I wouldn't, have, I wouldn't have said that. Because as soon as... I was thinking what he was saying, but I would never say it because it's like you don't want to say, oh, God, our main event just blew up. So Bray distracted him with the bridge, hit a urinage when Roman tried the Superman punch, went for the punch in the corner that we talked about, got power bombed, and finally goes for the sister Abigail. Roman cradled him, hit the Superman punch, hit the spear, pinned him clean in the middle. Pinned him clean in the middle. Let me repeat that. Couldn't get that out of Samoa Joe, but we got that out of Roman Reigns and Bray Wyatt. No, and that they, was the match. Well, I think that their mentality here is that Roman Reigns didn't win, and we got to keep Roman Reigns strong. So he needs some, and I mean it was a long, competitive back and forth match. You know, overall a good, good, op good way to start. I thought, you know, so that yeah, was yeah. a very good match. Even though the guy got tired, it was a pretty good match. Yeah, it was a good match. 